I think signs I hope that you are doing absolutely fabulous thanks for joining for your next set of readings which will run from the 1st of August through the 3rd if you are a returning welcome back and if you are um, new my name is Shannon and my channel looks at criminal activity and so you will hear information on this channel that could be disturbing to you at times but uh, you'll learn me as we go um, I could come across real churchy and religious and I'm really not at all Okay, I'm not churchy at all. I'm not religious at all. I'm for the truth, the whole truth, nothing but truth. But the scripture is found in the tarot. I have a Hebraic descent. I keep all ten of the commandments. I am connecting with the only wise king of the universe, the maker in heaven of earth. And his name is Jehovah. And I'm not ashamed of him, nor am I ashamed of his son that walked among us in the flesh. And uh, I like to say this on every one of my readings. Uh, so if you are brand new, so you can just kind of know who, you, who I am. And you can choose what you want to do with the energy. It's very profound on my channel. All praise, glory, and honor goes to the great king of glory and the host of heaven that is ran at his hand <clears throat> so anyway it's kind of who i am so uh if you stay great if not then thanks for checking me out away you'll go let's see what's going on happy birthday to leo uh, i'm going to take a card for each one of your uh, signs of taurus scorpio aquarius and leo here and see some energy for the next couple of days for you all you'll have to just come on in here and give some words for taurus scorpio uh, Aquarius and Leo from August the um, 1st through the 3rd. <clears throat> Taurus, you have a heartbreak. It's a heartbreak. Uh, I, I send you love and light or you're, or you're healing from this or something's piercing in the heart with the three of swords. And so that's heart energy. <clears throat> so you got the three of swords coming out on your energy. Show me um, Scorpio. <clears throat> Scorpio, there's some heartache here as well. Somebody's crying over something. and Or, or somebody's going to turn around and take the cups. Okay, so somebody crying over spilt milk. It's crying over something that's happened in some type of uh, indulging, you know, cup situation. I'm not sure. Aquarius, we have the Empress coming out. So the Empress, it, you could be dealing with your mother. Uh, this could be you, this could be your sister, it's a family member, could just represent none of that, and it could represent projects, um, <clears throat> could represent legal matters, could represent um, financial matters with her, could represent somebody who's out of balance, could also represent somebody carrying something off within some ordeal. Leo, thank you, that came out quick. There is a pentacle here. I always just pointed out in this deck, uh, the, if something is deceptive, there could be something deceptive around a pentacle or a contract or just something hidden or you need to use your intuition around a contract. There's a weasel down here. Uh, it could be a lie around something. There's a pregnancy here. There'd be a pregnancy here on you as well, Aquarius. All right, there could be messages coming in for some of you all in the next couple of days. Let's do some clarifying here. Let me take a smaller deck here. <clears throat> Show me what this heartbreak is for Taurus. <clears throat> Maybe you're dealing with heart issues. I'm not sure. For some of you all, that might be the case. But some type of messages are coming in about heart situations. Taurus, your energy can go back to hospitals and stuff. So if you're waiting on communication about some type of a heart situation... Uh, and that's medical stuff then something for some of you all would be here with that show me this um, third party for some or this heart wrenching thing with Taurus please Jehovah what is this <clears throat> what's the three of swords here for the emperor is here somebody's father somebody's business somebody's some somebody's somebody's door and somebody was coming in and out of the door. Uh, if you are new, this is the Dalit in the Hebrew is where I'm getting that represents a door. Okay. Somebody's heartbroken around some type of a war that went on within the home or with your husband or some type of protection energy. If you lost a father or you lost your husband by some type of a heart attack or something like that, something happened within somebody coming through the door and doing something caused some type of war, it's just heartbreaking, then something like that is here on this Three of Swords. There's the Empress right there. Well, that that's a match. There, there was a war, then there was a war here. Uh, there's some type of anxiety in somebody's heart around some match, then that's also here. This is a mother, father, business. Uh, the law could be here again because the empress is also here. Some, some, some type of situation with the emperor and 
home is here on your stuff, okay? Um, pregnancy issues as well. Somebody heartbroken over some type of pregnancy issue. If there's third party, I send you love and light. Show me the Scorpio energy. With the, What's this Five of Cups? This could be positive if you're turning around because that's a forgiveness card as well. There's some type of messages though here overall energy with this page either about work or something physical or teenagers or little children would be here. Okay? So something solid's coming in for a message. Show me the Five of Cups please. What's this Five of Cups, please, on Scorpio? What's it here for you, Hova? Somebody's grieving here. It's a command for the truth to come to the surface. Right now, you will come to the surface. Something's over. So somebody's going to turn around, take cups, and end something. Or somebody's crying because something did end. Some type of travel and... Um, Pentacles then would also be here but they go back to bank systems. Somebody's boss could be here as well. Um, somebody's tooth could be prevalent or somebody's leg. That's the letter shin. Somebody having to use their intuition to how to turn around to forgive something. Be a person of integrity as well on your energy. Well, there's a lie. Somebody's a guilty, babbling, nasty, freakish fool. I just did a reading on a, on a general on the day that I'm actually recording. The king of cups was there. That's your energy. Uh, some of y'all are in the upright. Some people are not. And somebody appears to be a person of integrity and they're a lying freak. Then somebody could be around some, some freak like that. Uh, hopefully that's not you, Scorpio. For some of you, it will be you. For some of you, it's the other person. There's a strategizing energy here. Okay, well, my God. If something's over, though. If that's positive and something's over because somebody got caught in a lie and even though it's grieving to some people, at least something's over. Okay, for some of you all. And that's something that has passed. And you're trying to use your intuition because you do need to turn around and talk about this guiltiness. Because somebody's guilty with the Seven of Swords and whatever's been stolen or thieved or lied about or whatever the crap that was. Um, then, you know, then you're, if you're able to turn around, there is a forgiveness here in all integrity. Uh, if you're going to speak about something that you know that has been deceiving. Show me the Empress, please, with Aquarius. What's the Empress here for Aquarius energy, please, Jehovah? This could be a grandparent as well with the Empress, obviously, empires. So we have the Four of Cups. In this deck, you can see the soulmates would be the Three of Cups in the deck. It's some, somebody's seeing some cup out of the cloud. And if they're covered up and somebody's ha stepping out because they're stuck in a rut within some relationship, because this is like a marital person um then something's here this is i'm stuck in a rut um this is a doll relationship if somebody's looking at somebody else's cup and something's here something got pregnant somebody got pregnant around that ordeal or might get pregnant around that ordeal if that's what that's representing otherwise if you're upright and you've got value and somebody around you's got value and just something beautiful is here and, and um it's also showing that some type of uh, a fortunate thing is here and maybe your soulmates don't like your connection but somebody's seeing something out of the cloud being handed by the divine it could go either way this can be a contemplating card somebody contemplating something um then I guess so. We've got some something public here with the Empress. There's a there's been a war. There's a victory, and somebody able to take a cup. Then for some of you all, then great. Show me the there's a there's some type of message though about it. And whatever the message is, might be why somebody is also um, either pouting or uh, contemplating something. Okay, again, if there's if there's money and legal matters around something, around your home or your mother or your wife or something like that, uh, then that energy is around you, Aquarius. Show me the Leo energy with this pentacle, please. What is this here for you, <clears> Hova? <throat> something from your past um, this is about being nostalgia children could be here the overall energy is it could be a child card as well or your parents would be here your mother something about your home your soulmates are here around this um pentacle if this is somebody returning from your past for forgiveness or having some type of a message about something from your past then that's here there is some type of travel there is some type of communication if somebody's under investigation for some type of a 
contract or something that's been deceptive around something very physical with children or a pentacle, then that energy is also here. So again, this is going to uh, confirm itself at the end of the deck here, or excuse me, at the bottom of the deck for messages and something type of travel energy around you guys is here. I'm going to take some words for you all. So if you are new, I'm just picking at random from this homemade deck here. You'll be you just pick for Taurus and show me what this is about, please. Show me um, Scorpio energy. Show me uh, Aquarius. Show me Leo, please. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Taurus, we have somebody who is not kind. Obviously, there's a heartbreak. This is warish energy. And so if you're dealing with your parents, because we did see the empress that was there, or some type of third-party love affair, or somebody got pregnant or something like that, somebody wasn't kind, then I guess they weren't kind. Um, you're also dealing with somebody who has a mental problem involved in some ordeal. Uh, above all things, put on love and the bond of perfectness. Well, somebody got piercing in the heart, okay? Somebody's warring even in their heart around some somebody who was not kind or you weren't kind and somebody's door of their heart is is sad and you just need to put on love and the bond of perfectness and do something where family matters are or around your husband or whatever that is these are your words take them as they apply if you're dealing with somebody who um slipped within some matter <clears throat> then so if it was your child or your father or, or you or whatever uh, some type of slipping or some type of being lame in the foot area or something like that then and somebody laughed or wasn't nice or some something went down within some ordeal I guess some, something like that is here that won't be for everybody if you're dealing with somebody obviously this can be somebody who's in the public eye or who has known or somebody is from um, um, uh, Louisiana or Alabama would be here um, or California, LA is here. Okay. Uh, if you're dealing with the singing energy, that's la 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 la. Something like that would also be here. Some, something with this energy is with those words for you. Uh, Scorpio, we have what comes around goes around. So something's happened here within your energy, and, and somebody's reaping what they sowed as well. And they've been crying over spilt milk. Something's closed out now because what, what happened, what you did also came around or that happened to the person that you're dealing with or whatever that is um we, we do have a, a mistress that's been here in your reading um somebody says what i would give to look into your eyes well somebody's crying here something's happened something went down something closed out maybe if that was a death or something like that i'm not sure that some kind of interject with physically emotionally something's here there's also a renewal of any kind for some of you all that are dealing with other matters again closing something out turning around forgiving it says it's positive here Somebody says, I will fight for you. That's positive. We also have a boss or the boss is involved in some ordeal. Some of y'all have a mistress or there was a mistress on the job with the boss. And somebody's like, did something. And somebody said, what comes around goes around. Or something's, you're being shown something's fixing to go down. Okay. In some ordeal, there's been a fight here. Then I guess so. And again, if that's past energy for some of you all and uh, that's a renewal of some kind, then great. That's a renewal and you'll get past it and you'll forgive and you'll walk in peace and love. Um, Aquarius, we have tears here. Okay. Uh, again, if you are dealing with family matters and something's went down and, and you've been crying, but now you're looking up at a cup and something's gone on with your family and you've been crying maybe something is um you know now refreshing to you it's good to sit down and have a good cry sometimes he always says that prosperity is is coming within some situation with you so if you've been crying over money then that's something positive that will come out uh this is rich and generous type of energy so or maybe that's you doing that to somebody or something like that maybe because you are now looking at some type of big cup if you're dealing with a cleaner, we have some type of uh, cleaning energy here or just cleaning something up uh, in general, some type of polishing or scrubbing or something like that, okay, whatever that means for you. We also, so sadness is here. We have tears over here on your stuff. There's been worry and fret and trembling and sadness, but, you know, some of you all, if you're in the upright, something's going to look good for you. Um, for some of you all, there is jail, prison, and justice here. This uh, empress can represent jail, her 
herself and somebody has been back and forth in some type of a matter but you always say no more there's some something going down then for those of you who are dealing with that energy all, all last um set of these we had justice over the top of everybody so there's some type of the eight of wands can be an investigation card so some of y'all are done with the investigation i guess so since so heartbreaking around some ordeals i guess so within some communication all right um leo your word is um something about your son is here or some type of a uh, being set free within a matter again again you are dealing with people that are that you are in um um, relationship with that is getting out of jail or something like that. I can read it that way as well. We have something to do with the spider and some type of a deception has been around you. It's right here. Okay. The moon will go back to that. We got a little weasel down here. So there is something that's been weaved. The internet is also showing up here. There's a lizard. Something perverse has also been around your energy. There's been another man involved in some ordeal. Well, somebody also had a mistress within some of this intertwined stuff. And um, so, well, there's another man involved. And if that's not sexual, then something's here. But we do have a pregnancy and children, though, that would be here. Or you're the other man. Something precious has been here. Well, children are precious, man. Um, an instrument player is here as well. So you deal with music, then you are. There's a contract here. Okay, so we know about some of that stuff. Um, we've got a desire and something of value is also here. Um, but there's also been a lust energy that's been around your energy. I'm going to take an overall rune for you all for six signs, and this will be your reading. Thank you, Yehovah. Show me six signs. So the um, DH and or the letter TH could represent something. Also, we have the D, the G, and the L, and the S out here, and then we uh, specifically for um, somebody had... L-A was also out here. So this makes the phonics of death. Okay. So somebody been investigated around death matters and children or teenagers and something's been deceptive around some ordeal that went down. Then, then the phonics of death is here. Somebody's been crying around something. There's some type of messages coming or something to be closed out or something like that. This goes back to uh, also calculations of things. Some people have calculated some things up some people are getting some money that is coming to them that's great especially if you've been crying over something that's happened uh you always sending some provision for some people then um this is strategy okay this is uh some people are dealing with people who have been in enchantment and stupidness like that somebody also gain some type of oh i found some good luck i better gather that thing up before uh, the uh unexpected uh dispels it and something for some of you all did not turn out very well and what comes around goes around somebody got a heartbreak somebody got deceptive stuff and there's jail in prison and there's mistress and the other man out here within some ordeal and so for some of you all this energy would be in the negative well i guess what comes around goes around uh, because it's real karmic energy then that is attached over fixed sign stuff. Um, this is what has come out for your energy. Until next time, Shalom.